Okay guys, so this one right here is my Dendrobium Amobile. I gotta tell you, I'm so excited with all of the gorgeous blooms that we're getting this year. I'm just really at awe here. So take a look at these blooms. So as I stated, this is my Dendrobium Amobile, and this grows very similar to the Dendrobium Densiflorums, the Thursiflorums, also the Farmerii's. So indeed, you are going to be seeing these very, very long canes right here, and this actually kind of dangles downward because it is so heavy. And then you are going to see these blooms Look at these that come off of this very long cascading and grape-like clusters right here and has somewhat of a wisteria type of cascading effect. Definitely a pendulous type of blooming orchid right here. And what I do love most about these is the fact that these can give so many blooms. And I do love the incredible display that it can give. And as you are seeing within the spike, it also has this very beautiful color. It's that lavender pink right there that you're seeing. And then on the actual petals, this almost seems white. I don't know how good you're going to see that pink in there but it does have a very very light pastel almost translucent pink in there and then of course you're seeing that very deep egg yolk yellow in the center just a gorgeous color combination from the actual spike to the stems and also to the petals and the actual throat area and if there was one thing that i could wish for this orchid right here is the fact that I wish that the blooms would last even longer because on these, these blooms will only last for about two weeks. Ah, uh, so sad to say. So you definitely are going to have to enjoy these blooms while they last. But of course, guys, the good news is if you do have a plant that has a lot of these bloom spice coming along, you may have these blooms for some time to come, just as long as you have a lot of bloom spikes. And you can find these orchids blooming either in the latter spring months or within the summer. So as I did state, you can have these very, very long canes right here. And they do say that these canes can get about three feet long. So you can definitely have a very, very tall plant. Over time, they may lose their leaves as you're seeing right here. And I do gotta admit, they're not that attractive when they do lose the leaves. But I will say the good news about these canes right here is that even though they've bloomed for you one time, they can actually rebloom off of the same cane so you never know guys these can actually bloom off of those leafless canes as well and I'm gonna show you one as you can see right here leafless cane and there goes the blooms so don't cut them off don't be quick to uh, be a uh, trigger happy or spiky happy I guess you would say to cut those off because you definitely may have a chance to get some more blooms guys and who wouldn't want more blooms this is an orchid that does appreciate your warmer conditions and it also does appreciate bright light conditions as well and does like bright indirect sunlight. Now, this is also an orchid that is considered fragrant, although I haven't really smelt a very intense fragrance on these, but they do have a very mild, sweet floral fragrance. Also take note that this orchid right here does appreciate being evenly moist, but does like to also have some dry time in between watering as well. And I will have to say, guys, this is a very interesting orchid to have. Definitely gives you a very tropical feel. And I love the fact of how it just really cascades downward and gives you quite an awesome grape-like cluster of a display of blooms. So if you've never tried any of these dendrobium types of orchids right here, I definitely would recommend it. It is a very easy to grow orchid and you do have such a great reward at the end of the blooming rainbow. 
And I sure do thank you guys so much for tuning in to yet another episode of My Orchid and also My Aeroid Adventures. And I hope you guys liked this video and I hope you guys did learn something new from it. If you did, please be sure to like, share, and also subscribe. And make sure you stay tuned for a whole lot more. I will see you guys later and I'll also grow with you guys later as well. Bye-bye for now. Mwah.